नमस्कार एंड हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू आवर चैनल माय ट्विटर आप सबका बहुत बहुत स्वागत है आपके अपने चैनल माय ट्विटर पर इट्स अ रिक्वेस्ट दोस्त न्यू टू माय चैनल काइंडली सब्सक्राइब एंड हिट द बेल आइकन सो दैट यू डोंट मिस द न्यू अपडेट्स सो लेट्स स्टार्ट विद आवर टूडेज टॉपिक हाउ एंड वेयर वी कैन यूज एक्टिव एंड पैसे रोजिट बॉडी इन माया ओके सो हाइल जस्ट ओपन द फाइल एंड दैट्स अ नेम विद सेटअप so this is what it is and uh, what we can see here is on surface few objects so where this cylinder will rot come rotating and hitting this object okay so all these things will be done automatically i won't be giving any kind of keyframe or animation so everything has to be done dynamically okay so that is the most important thing so that is the purpose of doing it okay so let's start and uh, i'll just select the plane and this object i'll get into fields and solvers i'll assign this as a passive rigid body after that i'll select uh, i'll just select this object hold the shift minus this one i mean the plane and uh, shift and select this cylinder so both of them are selected and i'll again go back to fields and solvers and i'll click on this active rigid body so click on this and this is defined as well as i'll assign gravity also so no need of going back and selecting it again so everything is been assigned let us check it out how it is going to react i'll just make it 300 frames or let us make it 400 okay so rewind and play so now 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 we can see like some thing is working out slowly slowly okay this is also coming down there is no at present there is no rotation and it will fall from there and then after that i suppose it will start rotating yes so this is how it is coming and slowly and steady it will go and try to hit it actually i don't want this to take more of the time for hitting the object okay so what i'll do here is i'll just go back and select the cylinder get into this option channel box layer editor and that we have like an option available like initial spin initial velocity initial mass and each and everything okay so for example what i'll do is i'll just increase the mass i'll make it say 25 rewind and play so definitely now there is a mass it is much more heavier now it has started moving now okay so that is there and also what i'll do here is i'll just make this object spin okay so i'll make this object spin in an x axis okay so i'll make it an angle of say 45 degree so rewind and play so now it is rotating in an opposite direction i'll make it as minus 45 degree so this will move this object in an opposite direction i mean in the correct direction so it has started rotating and this will start going down and uh, slowly slowly it is coming hitting having bounciness okay so i'll just see to it i'll decrease the bounciness value and uh, let us see what else need to be changes another 100 frames are added so that it just hit the object like here again 600 frames so basically uh, it has started working it but uh, not at the speed what i what i was looking for so in that case what i'll do here is i'll just uh, given initial velocity uh, like on a z axis i'll make it 0.5 i'll make it this as 1 okay and what i'll do is the bounciness part is 0.6 i'll just reduce that bouncing there i'll make it 0.2 fine and 
I'll just make this both value zero static and dynamic fraction initially and now let's see how it is going to react still it is taking more time what i'll do here is initial velocity i'll make it five now let us check oops sorry minus five so that was the reason it was going actually back in the reverse direction and then it was trying to hit it so that is the problem okay so now i suppose this will give us give us the proper output yes finally it hit it those objects and it is going back so now what i'll do here is i'll make this as minus 10 now more initial gain and uh, i'll make this as mass as 10 we'll get some friction about say 0.3 or uh, yeah fine that's So earlier it take around 400 frames to reach that particular position now it has taken only 250 frames and it reached the object so in that case i'll make this as minus 15 and uh, i'll just make it say 0.5 for an example so that it should have a friction at the base perfectly now with much more lesser time it has created a fantastic effect so around 300 frames only i have got the output now the only problem here is ki here what i can see here it is not going in a rotation pattern it is just moving up i mean because of the initial uh, velocity it is just taking ahead i'll just make it as more value i'll say i'll give it say um, around say minus 90 i suppose it should work now but still it's going straight up once it start hits after hitting it starts rotating say this since this ladder is like a plain ladder like a, i'll say perfect look at this output so it is not giving me that uh, like rotation values so what i'll do here is i'll just add few more objects into this
so now i'll just reduce the value so i'll make it minus 5 so that we can see the rotation exactly happening and it is tumbling down we can have that feel here perfect so this was the thing which is required because of those ladders were not there so it was not uh, allowing that object to react it perfectly so now it is doing it very perfectly and it is coming and hitting the object so minus 5 I suppose it is lesser but still it will it will still hit hit the object perfect yeah okay so now it has hit the object but uh, the objects are not uh, the, those boxes are still on, on one one above the other so I'll just stop it and uh, I'll just increase this value I'll make it say minus 10 uh, rewind and play one more time so now this will be in a better I'll say with a better force and definitely it will be hitting and uh, the objects or the boxes will definitely fall up now. Much better. Okay, so perfect. I hope you understood how to use active and passive rigid body in Maya. So subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for new upcoming videos. Click on thumbs up for like and share it with your friends. If any queries, write it in the comment box. Thank you so much for watching my video. Milte hain kuch aur extra tips and tricks ke saath agle video mein. Thank you.